A former NFL player is under fire tonight. It's our big story on 12 News at 6. Good evening. I'm Mitch Carr in for Mark Curtis. And I'm Kariba Devine. Court records show he owes his ex child support. Team 12's Bianca Bono talked to the mother of the child. And Bianca, how much money does he allegedly owe? Guys, court records show former Cardinals offensive lineman Jeremy Bridges owes her more than $100,000, an amount she says could be life-changing for their son. It has literally been a nightmare. Carmen Brown talking about the past 12 years of her life. It's not fair that I have to pay for everything for our son. She says she met her ex Jeremy Bridges back in 2001 when he was an offensive lineman at Southern Miss. She says they would go on to seriously date from 2003 until 2006. Along the way, Bridges was drafted by the Philadelphia Eagles, then traded to the Cardinals, and the couple had a son. He's a great little boy. He's flourishing. He's an honor roll student. He plays basketball. But Brown says the last time she and her son saw Bridges was on on their son's first birthday in April of 2007. Since then, she says Bridges has been absent and has mostly refused to pay child support. Their son is now 13 years old, and according to Arizona court records, Bridges owes Brown $107,000. Brown says her ex has still paid thousands of dollars per month from the NFL. In order for the arrearage to be at 107 grand, that's like obvious you know, gross negligence. From February through May, Bridges making monthly child support payments of $300, hundreds below his requirement. In April, a warrant was put out for his arrest, and in late August, he left his job as an offensive line coach at Gilbert High School. Every time you do a garnishment for wages, he sees that and quits that job. Brown's story is not unique. The Arizona Department of Economic Security website lists dozens of child support evaders. 12 News tried contacting Bridges for this story. In a Twitter message, Bridges saying, quote, please don't contact me about this again, then blocked me on Twitter. As for Brown, she says the state of Arizona is failing her, but she's vowing not to give up. Be a father to your son and take care of your responsibility. Brown has been supporting her son by herself for the past 12 years with infrequent and unreliable child support payments. But she says the state of Arizona should be doing more to hold Bridges and other parents accountable. We're in the Alert Center, Bianca Bono, 12 News. All right, Bianca, thank you.